Hello everybody, today I have something really interesting to share with all of you and something I've always wanted to add to my collection. This is a Bulbrite Starlight Bulb. It uses miniature incandescent bulbs inside of a standard incandescent bulb. Very interesting, I've seen these things online for many years. I have a colored version of one of these in my collection. Uh, I think I have a video of it, made it a long time ago. If I remember, I'll put it in the description down below. Anyway, this is just a clear version. So we have clear miniature bulbs inside of a larger bulb. This is a G40 size bulb with a medium base. We have five miniature incandescent bulbs inside. I've heard people call these like grain of rice bulbs, whatever you wanna call them. I assume these little bulbs are about 24 volts a piece. Since we have five of them, that would make 120 volts. But here we see it's 5 watts and 130 volts. So the bulbs must be a little bit more than 24 volts a piece. As they are in series, as you can see here in the picture, and you'll see that when I open it up here in a second. Of course, 5 watts, because the bulbs are 1 watt a piece. 5 inch globe, the G40 shape. These come in smaller shapes as well. Um, this is the largest one they make course standard information here on the side another picture and more information here as well these do last a very long time because of the the grain of rice bulbs they just last they last a very long time probably because they're in a series circuit so there's information there on the bottom and you can see what the bulb looks like here but it doesn't actually look like that they have it designed a little bit differently so there's the bulb itself. Now, as you could see in the picture, it showed a little spiral up to the top. But here you can see it's uh, more of a tree, a Christmas tree shape, I guess you could say, or something. If you look at it directly from the top, you can see it's all very centered there in the, the middle. We have our five little grain of rice bulbs. You can see, see the little tiny filaments inside of them there. Very simple and elegant. I really like it. Take a look at the base. You can see a bulb right 130 volt, 5 watt china. I'd love to get some smaller versions of these as well. We'll go ahead and screw it into our socket here. Let's turn it on. And there it is at full brightness. Now, when I was reading reviews for these things online, it doesn't matter where you read the review, people are like, these things aren't very bright. They're not bright at all. Well, what did you expect? You know, I don't understand. They're little grain of rice bulbs. This is made to be a decorative piece, and that's exactly what I wanted it for. I don't want it to be bright. I want this to be decorative and cool to look at, and that's exactly what it is. Let me go ahead and turn off these big lights. So with all the big lights off, you can see the uh, camera kind of uh, makes them a lot brighter than they actually are. I want to focus on them, but we're probably going to have a very hard time doing that. There we go. I'll change the exposure manually. Doesn't that just look cool? Spin it around there. See if I have to change it again. There you go, look at that structure inside. Absolutely beautiful. So we'll hold the bulb back out here. And I have a dimmer on this. So we'll go ahead and dim it down. Doesn't that just look awesome? <laughs> Too bad it's so sunny out today. I mean, it's, I'm not gonna complain. A sunny day is a nice day, but it's uh, hurting our video here a little bit. But I absolutely love it. Now, in person, it's a very dim glow. Of course, you can get these infinitely dim because they are incandescents. They're not LEDs or any other technology. I wonder if they still make these, actually. The website I got this bulb from uh, says that if you get the other sizes that they don't have in stock, they'd be on back order. So maybe they still do if they can still order them, I guess. 
bring it back up to full brightness here. Of course, it doesn't really light stuff up, you know, that much because it's made to be decorative, which is fantastic. That's what I want out of it. I want a decorative, beautiful bulb. And that's exactly what you get with one of these starlight bulbs. It'd be neat if they had a little bit more, you know, a couple more bulbs or it was a little spread out a bit more if it was a spiral design to the top. But I'm not going to complain. This thing is absolutely cool. Too bad the camera doesn't focus on much, so I'll just change it myself. Yeah, I've always wanted to add one of these to my collection. And once you know it, here we are. Finally, one has been added. We'll turn these incredibly bright lights back on and we'll bring back the box so we can take a look at the box and the bulb for our last part here. Well, I really do hope you enjoyed this unique bulb. I certainly hope they still make these things because they are pretty cool. Also, please comment, rate, share, and subscribe. And thank you very much for watching.